Hey guys, this is Mark here from PFT and today we are going to be doing one of the most requested videos on this channel Tour of my desk Now, um, just to show you here, this is the camera setup I'm using for this um, I thought it'd be nice to give you that slightly higher quality than my compact camera So please forgive me for shakiness or um, wrong focus I actually have this on servo focus I believe it's called So it should automatically focus onto anything but um, it's not really seeming to be too good at that right now but um, hopefully this works I also have this guy up here so hopefully that should help you can't really see my face right now um, but yes let's get into this desk tour so this is kind of a tradition for the first um, of each year so um, yep let's jump into this and I will show you around my desk so first up here, um, I suppose I should show you this desk. This desk is from, I believe, something along the lines of onlinefurniture.com. I will of course leave a link to that and everything else you see here down in the description so you can purchase that if you want. Um, so first of all, at the side of this desk we have a drumming practice pad. Um, uh, again, I'm not sure if this focusing thing um, will work to, um, okay it's probably not going to. So anyway, this is a practice pad so basically you can practice rudiments and things like that and I have the drumsticks down the back there. <coughs> Next to that we have my iPhone 5 right there and my iPad mini first generation which is still my two daily drivers basically um, I really like those. Behind that we have my Samsung CO1U microphone with the Samsung pop filter and a terrible mic stand right there. I just keep that there in case I need to pull it out for recording videos or something like that. As you can see I have my tripod set up there as I've just recorded a video. Now moving my chair out of the way, I suppose I should show you that. This is a chair from Staples. Um, it's nothing special, it does the job. Nice mesh back here um, and some armrests so that's kind of nice. Sitting down in the chair, you can see my view, and these are kind of my pride and joy, my two 23-inch LG monitors, and you can see that kind of background displayed across them. I know this looks slightly more green than this one on the kind of camera, but believe me, that is, uh, I think that's just a fault in the wallpaper, to be honest. Once you kind of go into um, opening up programs and stuff, everything looks fine. Now, underneath these, in fact, I will quickly show you the model number here, uh, <laughs> if that's going to focus, which, again, it might not. In fact, I shall turn this into manual focus for you there. 23EA63. Again, links will be in the description. Now, these are sitting on a Duronix monitor stand. So, you can see that there. It basically allows me to fully pan until I can switch them Around that ways and um, sometimes I can even twist them around so that I can lie on my bed and watch something but um, basically yeah I have full kind of movement there to change them into any position and that is just uh, clamped onto the desk you can see next my little guy there and my knife here this is my unboxing knife uh, it's quite a nice knife I suppose again links will be in the description and um, so yeah that's a really nice stand for the monitors and that's what I use you can see the cables coming up out the back and then we have charging cables over here so we have uh, lightning 30 pin and micro USB. Moving over that we then have the Perix keyboard here you can see fully backlit I just have it on the mode where it changes around all the different colors so that's kind of cool as well I suppose. Um, it's also got volume control here that I don't really use and this little USB out thing is very handy because that connects to my wireless mouse here which is the Logitech MX performance mouse very good mouse it also has these programmable buttons on the side of it which um, I use quite a lot and are very very handy um, try and pull focus there for you moving on round the desk in fact moving up we have a cork board with some random things stuck on it and a whiteboard right there and of course some tinsel for the Christmas spirit the one you've watched this uh, Christmas is probably passed by now. Back here we have some whiteboard pens, um, which I use for the whiteboard. Then we have an array of stationery, microfiber cloths, pens, pencils, rulers, things like that. Um, some school books there. 
a notepad here which I use for kind of revision and also um, I write down notes for videos, um, ideas, uh, bullet points, things like that. Moving down underneath the desk we have my headphones right there and um, they're pretty terrible, they're skull candy headphones. Um, I use them with my computer usually because I don't actually have speakers with my laptop. We then have, I believe, the third gen iPod Touch, which I don't even know if it's still working, but I just kind of like to keep that. And then uh, another Victoria Knox Swiss Army knife that again is out of focus. Apologies for that. Next, we have a remote which controls the LEDs, which I actually have mounted along behind my desk there. So you can see that's just breathing mode. You can put it through all these different colours and then there's some presets down here. So for example, you can put it on flash, which um, kind of goes between the colours. There you can see it can go crazy like that. Uh, that's a different flash mode or the, these breathing modes, things like that. Quite a nice kind of thing to have on your desk. Uh, it just kind of adds another aspect to the room I suppose. Under here we have a drawer which has headphones, battery packs, speakers and kind of stationary like staplers and hole punches and I believe some DVDs up the back and a mini filing cabinet <laughs> as I pull the headphones off I have a mini filing cabinet down here which has papers, schoolwork, things like that Up the back you can kind of see there we have a graphics tablet and, and external hard drive and under here we have the laptop itself, I'll just turn up my LED light a bit so that you can see that. So that's a Sony Vio, I'm not sure the exact model number but I will definitely put that down below. And underneath we have a mess of cables and chargers and things like that. But I don't need to show you that now because um, it's fairly bad down there. Now my desk, as I'm sure you can guess, is not always this empty. There's usually piles of paper and things like that sprawled all over here but I tidied it up because I thought that would be nice to show you um, in this video. Now that is about it for this video. I really hope you enjoyed it. If you did please give this a like, share and subscribe to my channel for more content. Now I will definitely be doing room tours and things like that um, later on in the year but um, yeah that's gonna be it for now. Um, if you enjoyed this video as I said please give it a like, share and why not subscribe to my channel for more content. If you've got any questions, leave them down below in the comments section or email me at the address in the description. Thank you very much for watching. See ya.